And Trump is also the focus of today's Wall Street beat. His media and technology group is plunging after the company registered its shares for a potential resale. To know what's going on here is Bloomberg's Bailey Lipschultz. He's here to explain. Explain the stock reaction here. It's already been down four weeks. Yeah, so, Shanali, so the big news today is that this is a step towards insiders like Donald Trump and other founders to sell shares and registering also the warrants that could be swapped along with $11.50 for shares. But the big thing is, as you mentioned, this is about down two straight weeks, was trading north of $66 um, in the aftermath of its, uh, its debut on the NASDAQ, now closer to 27 or 26.75. So just a number of updates, losing momentum. We've watched volumes dwindling. We've seen options that had been a big driver of the stock to the upside, not as active. So a lot of kind of underlying factors actually mattering finally. Well, let's talk about the payday as well, because even though billions have been wiped out of the market value of this company, you do see a significant payday here for Donald Trump himself. Yeah, Shanali, as long as he's able to eventually sell the shares, that's the big focus. But right now on paper, worth about $2.3 billion. Granted, it was north of $5 billion. And as long as the stock trades above $17.50, Donald Trump and a number of insiders are basically in line to get another 40 million shares. So that's worth just north of a billion dollars. So a a lot of paper money, a lot of paper value for the former president. The big thing, though, is that he is locked up from selling shares currently until September. So depending where the shares move over that time frame is where that matters. Well, well what's the risk here? Because right now you have it around $27, mm -hmm. right? You have, it's $10 away from the price that you're talking about, $10 until September. What's the direction of travel here? Well, the big, Where's the floor, I guess? Th there's no real floor for Donald Trump. It's just a question of how much he could sell it for. So when you look at it, he owns almost 60% of the company as it stands before those additional earnout shares. So paper value aside, where, whether it's trading at $2 or $5, if he can liquidate shares and liquidate the stake in September, you know, it's north of $150 million, a couple hundred million dollars, which is a positive for Donald Trump. But a far cry from the north of five, six billion dollars that this was trading valued at just a couple weeks ago.